Council to the Cubs. And now we join uh, J.P. Morosi and the guys in Arizona. Thank you, Matt. The general managers meetings begin with a lot of talk about the managers themselves. About 10% of the entire industry found a new manager on Monday. Joined now by Joel and John. John, what's your biggest takeaway from today? Well, it's a surprise that Craig Council went to the rival Cubs from the Brewers, his hometown team. That is certainly the most interesting thing. We thought that the Mets and the Brewers were the biggest players there, and he had opportunities to go to both of those teams as well. Gets a record deal from his rival team, 90 miles down route 9094 good for Craig Council he's obviously a terrific manager the Mets rebound and hire Carlos Mendoza from the Yankees and we know Stephen Vogt to the Guardians which was their other choice which they liked him very much and we still got a lot of managerial doings to go but big day so far I think Craig Council was a domino short term and long term once Cleveland knows they can't get counsel, they go vote. Once the, Yang, uh, the Mets know they can't get counsel, they go Mendoza. And the big picture for counsel is, as John mentioned, he got a record deal, five years at $40 million. The domino is now he reestablished what the top manager should get. This used to be what top managers got 10, 15, 20 years ago, like at least a few of them, Joe Torre Joe in, Torre. in particular. <laughs> yeah. But like, there's no reason to me in the world why they shouldn't get number four, number five starter money. And I wonder if for some of the more established guys, he He's at least got them up to four, five, six. He could, some guys could draft with him. Yeah, I wonder what Bruce Bochy is worth now, yeah. right? I mean, that Bruce Bochy at four million plus looks like an amazing bargain. It did anyway. Four titles. I mean, four World Series titles. He's one of the greatest managers of all time. He's now making half, at least on the guarantee, what Council is making. So. Council really established something new here, I think. Obviously, Tory was there, but nobody else. And, uh, you know, great job by Council as representative and uh, certainly a, a shocker here on day one. It's amazing, John, that things kind of go back full circle. There was the time where we looked upon managers as these oracles so wise and tenured in the game. Well, the last three World Series all won by the three oldest managers in Major League Baseball this year. Maybe we're getting back to that where it's less of a middle management position position, to be honest, and more of that figurehead of the entire organization. Well, you can see that a manager does make a difference. I know that's a narrative out there, the manager does make a difference, but let's say he makes a two-game difference. A two-war two is still worth 12 to $16 million, right? So you could still say all of them are underpaid at this point. Uh, they're certainly the spokesman for the team. They take the heat. Uh, you know, I don't begrudge anybody getting what they can get, and Craig Council should get a thank you from all the other managers, except David Ross. Look, well, well, owners and, and GMs end up being mimes and good at hide and seek. They don't come out. The right. manager has to be right. out there <laughs> about 500 times a year for nine months before and after every Not practice, easy. every game. And by the way, they might get a script from up front. The guys who hand the script don't get caught, killed on talk radio and cable and in the newspapers and online. The manager does. Right. And that's really worth a lot more than most They of these also don't have the them. questions, too. Right. I mean, they get, he, they get surprise questions, and certainly Council's going to have a lot more media now in Chicago. Mendoza's got a totally new situation from bench coach now to manager across town. You know, we'll see how that works out. The Mets gambles like that in the past have not worked except for Davey Johnson. Maybe he's another Davey Johnson. We'll see. Craig, Craig Council, once upon a time, a leader in the MLBPA as a player. He has set the market for his brethren now in the manager's chair as well. Matt? 